guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm so happy that I'm back in here with a new video. Today I have my everyday winter makeup routine. This is what I do when I want to wear makeup. I don't do this every day because some days I just want to get out the door and I just not even not even foundation. I just go out without anything on my face. But when I like to wear makeup, this is what I do. Also, I'm really sorry that I couldn't upload a video last week. Um, there's a big, huge transition going on in my life that, yeah, is gonna benefit, benefit. It was gonna be good for my channel and for my life, I, I guess. I, I, I think. <laughs> well, but it's a big, big transition. It's huge and. I have been really emotionally on it and and wasn't in the greatest mood so I didn't want to upload a video with this face you know it that that is not the energy that I want to transmit on my channel I want to be happy I want to make you guys happy and you know it is not good to upload videos when you're sad. It, it is not even good to edit videos when you're sad because you just don't want to do anything. Uh, so yeah, guys, this is what I have to you for you today. I hope you enjoy watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel, thumbs up this video, and <laughs> yeah, leave a comment down below telling me what is your favorite, favorite makeup product. Let's jump into it. So guys, first I'm priming my face with my Clinique Super Primer. I love it, it's super lightweight. Then I'm using my Carmex Moisturizing Lip Balm. And now I'm applying my foundation. And this time I'm using my Garnier Beauty Cream in Deep. I really like it, it's super, super, super lightweight. It covers, but it is not too like heavy. So now I'm using my brush and comb. I dip it in my brow powder and then I brush my eyebrows and this is like a little beauty hack. I love it. It saves a lot of time. Now I'm using my e.l.f. concealer in medium to highlight in my brow bone. And then I'm concealing my under eye circles. I'm doing a little triangle shape so it covers my dark under eye and also acts as a highlighter. And then I'm priming my eyelids with it. And now I'm concealing my dark, dark spots or blemishes for my acne. Now I'm using my CoverGirl Clean Oil Control Face Powder to set my foundation and my concealer. And now I'm using a little clear mascara to set my eyebrows in place, as I forgot before. Now I'm using my Maybelline Pure State Powder Foundation as a shadow. I like this because it brightens up my eyes. Now I'm using my Maybelline Master Duo by Eye Studio Liner. Guys, I hate this one. I don't know, it's so hard to apply. It separates. I don't know, I just don't like it. It's Maybe later, if they change the formula, I will like it better. Um, next, I'm using my Wet n Wild Color Icon Eyeliner to line my tight line. And then I'm using my Maybelline Big Eyes Mascara, applying a couple of coats so my eyelashes look beautiful. And then I'm applying it on my 
lower lashes and I'm applying it really close to the lash line so it can act as a as a eyeliner if you know what I mean now I'm contouring my face with my Maybelline brow powder I'm using a foundation brush, brush because I feel like it's more precise and then I'm blending it with a blush brush then applying it on my forehead and on my jawline to give my face a little bit of dimension then I'm applying a rosy reddish blush I'm not really filming the blush that I'm using because I feel like every skin tone needs a different color to look natural on it and then I'm using my NK lip liner it's like a reddish orangey type of color I really like it it gives a little bit or tiny bit of color but it also looks natural and this is the finished look I hope you enjoy watching this video sorry about the late uploading that I have had lately subscribe to my channel comment down below like this video I love you guys and you have supported me so so much and I'm so happy about it so yeah See you next time.